Being new to the city, it's always seemed so transient. Like no one stays here, no one puts roots down here. And in 2009, I started a new job and I was kind of lost. And I didn't know, I would, I'd moved to a different city. I left all of my community behind. I was angry, you know, I just, I just was looking for something. My parents were turning 90 years old, getting a little older, and I decided to take early retirement and move to Vegas to be closer to them. I was looking for a church, and one of my girlfriends had moved to Vegas three or four years before. And I asked her what church she was attending, and she recommended Canyon Ridge. And when I first came to church, I saw a lady outside, and she looked so well put together and I followed her. <laughs> I wanted to know where she was sitting. And so I was just drawn to her. And I met her, she introduced herself, and she made me feel at home right away. And she introduced me to the people who were sitting around her. And I came to find out later that they had been sitting together for the last 10 years. And they just welcomed me into their family. From that, she introduced me to Women of the Word and she invited me to her table group and the rest is history. I'm able to walk alongside other women just like me, single, married. We all bring something to the table. What I like is that none of us is perfect. We're all just walking this life. And so we can learn from each other. One of the series that Drew went over was Acts 2. And that has just resonated with me. The fact that the new believers, they shared meals together, they formed their community together, and they just started walking life together as believers. The fact that my table group, they get together outside of WOW, and they share meals together. We potluck together. We become family, a true family. There was a time in my life when I was angry, alone, and afraid. But now with Jesus, I have community, I have love in my life, and I'm excited. I'm excited for the new beginnings and what this new chapter in my life looks like. Do you have a story like that? <laughs>